into the pistol here. First play, it's a handoff to Niall Sheathers. He gets the edge. There goes Niall, a big chunk play to start us out. Will this be the game of Niall Sheathers? Deep drop here for, and they hit him over the middle. Another big play, it's Trent Mills. What's the play call here for Flame? Deep drop here over the middle. Wide open, man, there he goes. Mike Brown for 24. What is the call? Quick throw. Looks at the option. He's going to throw. It's Chase Boggs. No. He goes the other way and they trip him up. Trent Mills saves the touchdown. But there he is. Boggs makes his presence known on the opening possession. Second and five now. They're going to audible. Hand off again. Swain keeps this one. And he's going to spin past everybody. A nice 17 yard. Safety coming on down. That's white. They blitz him. Three blitzers. Oh, they called a screen. What a call. It's Brandon Adams in the open field. There he goes. Oh, he runs over a man. Touchdown, Cornhuskers. They take the lead in the netty. Another handoff here to Sheathers. He cuts inside. Finds some room. Oh, and he's tripped up by Jakeem Bobo. Seven in the box. Quick throw for Sanders. Out wide. That's all. Oh, that could have been another one. Third and 13 now for your Baylor Bears. Deep drop. They're going to do a screen themselves. They got Sheathers out in open space. He has a lot of room. There he goes. Can they catch him? Yes, they do. 37. Man in motion. They're hurrying it up now. Threatening the red zone. Trying to tie this game up. It's an all-out blitz. They run the screen again to perfection. It's Sheathers down the sideline. He's pushing down at the one. Hand off here to Sheathers. Up the gut. Touchdown, Baylor. We got a tie game. Four-man rush. Swain takes off. And he trips over his own feet. He goes down. That's going to be a sack. Swain keeps it. He's pushing. And he's going to be short. Going to hand this off to Sheathers. He gets a hole. There's a big run. He has the lead blocker. Can they get him? Sheathers. Yes, finally tracked down by Quentin Appleby. So here we go. Third down and goal. The handoff. Sheathers up the gut. Touchdown, Baylor. They take the lead. A punt here would be horrible. Swain, he's going to throw it. Plenty of time over the middle. Hits his man. And it's a hang on from Washiko. Swain he throws it deep. Hits his man. Oh, what a hit. But Bobby hangs on. Man in motion. Going to be a screen again. And they can't get their balls on the ground. They pick it up. This is risky. 52 yards from Ray Hash. The kick is up. And it's no good for the corn. Out empty here for Sanders. Four man rush. He has time. Yams that one. And it's a completion. Mike Brown again. Man in motion now. It's Mills to the backfield. They hand it off to Sheathers. Big hole up the gut. Trips right. Another handoff. It's a counter. There goes Sheathers inside the five. Four wide. Second and goal. Sheathers, they fake it. To the end zone open. Man, that's a touchdown. Mike Brown, nobody covered him. Flip backs here for Nebraska. They fake them here this time. He flips it out. There's Adams. He gets a big play. Can't break the tackle, but big play nonetheless. They're running hurry up now. Down two scores. Split backs. Bring a blitz. Swain takes off. He finds the edge, and he breaks one. He's still going, and he slides. Another nice play. The season 15 national championship in Indianapolis. They bring a blitz. Swain, he has time. He's going to take off again. There's nobody, not even a spy. That's another big gain. Back to the split backs. Going to be another pass. Swain to the end zone. Open man. Touchdown, Bobby Williams. Did he step out? I don't think so. Crowd getting into it now. Fans that traveled from Nebraska. Definitely closer for Nebraska fans. And a broken play. Sanders goes down. He ran right into Clyde Starr. Sanders drops back. He has the time. No, he runs out. 
He gets the ball out, but it's incomplete. Our last game of the NCAA 14 era. Nebraska on the return. Green Davis goes down. They're calling this a fumble. Wait a second. Yeah, he's down by a million. So Swain now going to yam that one, and he finds his man, Washiko Johnston. Banking on his defense. Here we go. Two minutes. It's a screen pass to Adams. Can they sure this one up? Yes, they do. Plenty of time for Sanders yet again. He's yamming this one deeper. First yam of the game. And it dipped away by Blair Olsen. Edwards in motion. Time again. Floats that. There's Weber. He breaks a tackle and brought down by Bobo, but no face mask call. Second and seven, Mills in motion. Just across the 50. Sanders, quick throw again, and this time he's speared by Davion Tart. Sanders, free blitzer, floats it, hits his man, and dropped. Appleby knocks it out. Oh, it's a fake punt here in the natty. Baylor pulling out the trickery. He yams it, and he's short. Casey Kelly makes the play, but he's short of the line to gain. I'll be honest, that was probably one of the better throws we've seen today. That was not a wobbler. That was beautiful as we get a false start. Oof. Four man rush. Swain hits him. What a throw. Stays in bounds. Drive continues. Swain now to the end zone. Open man. Arian Green Davis on your dome. Shades of Sawyer Rationelli. And we got a tie ball game, folks. And as we hit halftime, folks, here on game day, this is your reminder that we do run on a five-day schedule. And if you want even more content throughout the week on those off days, to check out patreon.com backslash the SFA. The links are in the description. You can get an additional game day every week through Watch Party. You can get access to the Playoff Push, which is an exclusive podcast for Patreon members only. And you can even name recruits. Uh, so if you're interested, check out patreon.com backslash the SFA for much, much more. Swain, what's the call? Man in motion, that's Williams. They hand it off to Adams, and he goes nowhere. A pack of bears up the gut. Well, all right. What does Sanders have in store for us now? He yams a deep first play. 50-50 tipped away by Olsen and Tart. Nebraska defending the yam with their life tonight. They may not be defending the run, but they're defending the pass as Tubby Page lets up a banger to DJ Weber. And no, Weber's out of the game! No, 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 no. Their best receiving target out. Second and one now, Sheathers to the outside. And he somehow gets the first. Sanders. Drop back, four-man rush. Yams that to the corner, and it's broken up. It's Blair Olsen again. This will be a, what is this, a 38-yarder from left hash. Take the lead. It's good. Second and six. Hand off to Brandon Adams. He switches field, breaks a tackle. Big play from Adams, and he gets 11. Third and two. Hand off to Adams, and he's stopped. Takes the hand off to Sheathers. Hits the throw. It's it's solo. Tippins with a big play on his first catch. They're throwing it again. Deep drop for Sanders. He has some time. Floaties. And that's going to be dropped. Oh, Jacob Phillips had a chance. Sanders. Sanders floats it to the outside. And that's out of bounds. Third and 12. Swain drops back the corner blitz. He escapes it. He throws a dinker. Sanders drops back again. Yams this one. Deep open, man. Down the sideline. Broken tackle. Bog saves the tutty. Third down here for the Baylor Bears. Sanders drops back. He has the time. He yams that, and that's a first. 
First and goal. Going to be a throw from Brent, or Sanders. Dumps that backwards. Risky business for Nile. Touchdown might cement this. Second and goal. Sanders. He sacked! Nebraska desperate for a stop. Sanders. Quick throw. He's hit again! Fourth down! From right hash. 35 yards. And it's good! 27-21. First and 10 here for Julius Swain. All out blitz. He throws it. Oh, that was it! Chase may have just fumbled a natty. Quick option. He puts it on the turf. Baylor has it. There it is. Julius Swain. Mills in motion. They're going to throw it on the goal line. Sanders, he goes down. Trips left. Sanders going to throw it. Sanders has time, delivers a strike, and it's tipped away. And they're going for it! What are you doing? No! Stop! Call a timeout! No, they're doing it! No! Sanders to the end zone! Touchdown, Baylor! Ball's in the throw, Baylor! They hit the jugular! They still have time. They need a touchdown and utilize those timeouts. They yam this one. He hits them. Oh, it's dipped away. The last five minutes here in NCAA 14. Dumps this off. He hits his man. Got to make a play, and he doesn't. Game on the line for the corn. They hand it off. He keeps it at Sanders, and he gets there. They hand it off to Sheathers to the outside. And he's tripped up by Boggs. Yams is deep. He hits him. In the hospital ball. Oh, Wishiko couldn't bring it in. Swain floats it. That's a first. Swain drops back. Only a four-man rush. He has some time. He yams it deep to the corner. It's late. And out of bounds. Swain hits him. Hits Green Davis. That's a first. Swain steps up. Swain hits from behind. It's a fumble. Baylor picks it up. And as we hit triple zeros here in season 15, Coach Flame finally does it. The longest tenured coach since before we even had SFA players. He suffered through the sim matchup era. He suffered through the days of the Big 12 dominance. He suffered through six other appearances that ended in disaster in the CFP. And he finally, finally goes out on top here in the NCAA 14 era. And for Nebraska and Coach Zach, their storybook ending ends in a nightmare as another runner-up season here for the Corn. What a game, what a season, and what an ending to season 15. Baylor gets it done. Coach Flame lifts the trophy. Finally, the legacy is completed. Baylor is on top of the college football world. And they will get the cover for season 16. 34-21 is your final. Thank you guys so much for watching, so much for supporting, and we'll see you in College Football 25.